The old man wasn't kidding. The shelter is huge. Back system activated. Back system off. Down to die! Glad that's over with. Bat system activated. Bat system off.
Back system activated. Back system off. System activated. Back system off. Back system activated. Back system off. So this tunnel comes out at the highway on the other side of the ravine. Now we know how to get to the other side. Jesus, we're finally out of those tunnels. I didn't think we'd ever get out. In any case, Sam should be pleased that he won't have to go for a swim. Yeah, Sam will want to get over here as quickly as possible. Wait, 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 wait. Hold the phone. So you're telling me that there's actually an unfinished tunnel system Underneath Merida Port? Pretty much, Sam. I feel like it's supposed to be a sewer system for a vault tech vault. However, I have no clue where said vault would even be. So now people here use it as a pass-through tunnel to the other side. Interesting. That's the idea, I guess. We didn't go very far past the exit. We came straight back once we found where it terminates. So you have no idea what's past the tunnel exit? You just poked your head out and then came straight back? Only because I know you're so damn eager to find that bank that you would have done the same. You know me better than I thought. God, I don't know about you, but I'm convinced everyone in this town is crazy. I'm ready to head out. Are you? Finally! I'll meet you outside with the rest of the group. It's time to find this bank. Wait, kid, hold up for a second. I told your buddy to go talk to my dad earlier about that bank. 
I know Dad's kind of an asshole, but he means well. Twenty-five years ago, he was a part of a group of people that attempted to do the same thing y'all are doing now. He was the only one that survived. Raiders had set up a camp in the bank, ambushed them when they let their guard down. I'm pretty sure those junkies are still in there to this day. Anyway, the old man told me to give you this hollow tape of scouting notes from that mess years back. I don't know how much you can get from it. I wish you guys luck. Dad never could let the bank go. And I'm hoping you can give him some peace over it. Maybe we can dig up something in that shack nearby. Let's see if that guy knows anything. Why the hell were there so many ghouls in that city? A new quest has been added. Say, that mayor's got a few skeletons in the closet that we probably don't want to know about. Anyway... While we were headed here, I pulled the new kid aside and saw that he had a holotape from Natalie, the barkeep. Ooh, Natalie? Someone's on first name basis with the barkeep. <laughs> Hard, yee, hard, Tank, as I was saying. She handed the new kid a holotape containing old scouting reports from before a raid her dad and a few others attempted years back. Can't we just shoot them all up and blow through the locks and vault door? Do all of your solutions have to involve using shitloads of explosives? Uh, maybe? Oh, whatever. The notes say that the main road to the bank is blocked, but there's no mention of any alternate routes. A uh, major oversight indeed. Well, out of there. I'm Jimmy. What brings you all by this way? A history lesson, huh? Well, I think I can oblige. Settle in, because this one's going to be a long story. Okay, here goes nothing. I pulled all this off of a terminal on a big market up north a while back, so my memory might be a little spotty. Back on a 350 years ago, some gentleman named Robert Shit decided to open up a new branch of his chain stores. Shit's Market, I believe. Of course, there's no point in building a mega store without building a town around it. And of course, there's no way you can have millions of dollars to yourself without having a lavish bank to put it in. The Rocky Cape Bank was built in, I believe, 2039 originally to store Robert Shit's massive fortune. Now, the security system put into place was just good enough to attract government attention. Thus, the feds wanted to use the vault as well. There's no telling what was moving into the vault, and no one's been able to crack the seal on it since before the Great War. I'm sure many have tried, but all have come up short. I'd always wondered what's in it myself. I hope someone gets into it eventually. And really, that's pretty much the entire story of the bank. Big chain owner builds a town around his store and builds a bank to store his fortune. I'm not too sure about how to actually get past the rubble, but I do know that the people in the village below might be able to help. Behind this hill is a village laid on a wetland named Flackland. Try asking that. I haven't gone out that way in a while. Could you let Mayor Road know I said hi? He lives in the town hall for this back building near the town guard barracks. Yeah, she lives here with me. Her name is Elizabeth. She reminds me of her mother so much. Stubborn as a Brahmin, naive but intelligent. Very inquisitive. Always asking questions, never satisfied with an answer at face value. I only wish she could have met her mother and brothers. If she's not here, she's out scavenging for spare parts for weapons. I asked her to modify a set of assault rifles for me. I had twin boys, but I hadn't seen them in God knows how long. They were just up and left one day, probably about 25 years ago. They were just kids at the time. No explanation, just up and disappeared. Liz is just a toddler at the time, so she doesn't remember any of it. Well, their mother disappeared right around the same time, maybe a couple days before that. I no idea what happened to her either. Alright, anything else I can help you with? Well, y'all have a good one. Come on back, you hear? Hey, you guys must be new to the area. If Dad hasn't introduced me yet, I'm Lizzie. He hates calling me that, but that's what I go by. You'll have to have a word with my dad about that. I don't know anything about the bank. 
Yeah, it's kind of quiet out here, but no one bothers us. I prefer it that way. No raiders, no traitors, just the sweet sound of silence. And ramen mooin. Don't forget the endless mooin. Stay safe. We meet again, kid. I see you have Samuel Decombe and his group with you this time. Nothing now, because we have bigger fish to fry. The mayor in this village had valuable information regarding the RC bank vault. You're correct. Unfortunately, the raiders ransacked this village and stole tons of valuables, including what we believe to be one of the key cards. The worst part is that there isn't anything resembling a clue as to where the keycard was taken. What do you think I want you to do, outsider? Find the damn thing. Search the houses around here for anything that might lead to the keycards. My unit is going to go to another part of the island. As stated before, don't bother looking for us. We'll come and find you.
Bat system activated. Target selected. Bat system. Entry accepted. Light on. Light on. Light off. Wow, talk about a war zone. Let's head upstairs. Whoa, oh, shit. He wasn't wrong. Hey, that radar actually had a map. Looks like it's for Clearbank sewers as well. I guess Mayor Rowe was ambushed and took out all these raiders by himself uh, before succumbing to his injuries. You know, I'm curious as to what this vault door actually looks like. No way it's as complex as everyone we've asked says it is. Everyone we've asked has made a big deal about actually getting inside the vault, but no one seems to know specifics. These raiders seem to be doing a great deal to keep anyone they can away from it. No kidding. I think we should head back up to the old man's shack and see if he possibly knows anything more about what the hell happened down here. A quest has been completed. A new quest has been added.
Had it. Did you go to Flatland? How's Mayor Rowe? Oh, wait, what? Did I hear that right? Ransacked! Oh, say no more. You just confirmed to me what I feared. Now I know for sure the pirates are responsible for this. Yes, I read a group of came around years ago. They seem to be taking a massive interest in the bank. I have my suspicions as to why they are and who might be calling the shots, but I need to get on to Steric Island to confirm. I knew about the pirates, I knew they were occupying the bank, but I didn't know Flackland was ransacked. I don't want to say right now because I'm not certain who it is. I don't want to mislead you. I need to get on Steric Island to confirm if my theory about the pirates is correct. I want to ask you a big favor. I need you to go to a shipyard near the old dry dock on the south side of Clearbank. The pirates have a small hub that they use to transport prisoners between the mainland and Steric Island. On that island is an old jail that they use as a base of operations. That may very well be where the missing Flackland residents have been taken to. If the records aren't terrible, there should be some sort of transit manifest that will give the date and time of the next boat to the island. I need you to bring me that manifest. If my past experiences with the pirates are accurate, they are very organized and very on point with how they operate. Granted, this makes the choice of the pirate name rather confusing, but I've seen more strange combinations. However, I digress. Go get that manifest to bring it back to me. We'll use it to figure out when it would be the best time to get over to the jail. <laughs>